A heartbreaking story we have been following today. A little boy died while hiding from a fire that raced through his home. It happened overnight. 19 News, we have been reporting on this tragedy all day since early morning. Our Harry Boomer live in Sandusky now with the latest Harry. Well, this house behind me is the shell of what it was just hours ago. It is also the sad scene where a toddler full of fear tried to hide from the fire and smoke that took his innocent life. They ended up finding him underneath the bed in the bedroom on the second floor. A deadly house fire took the life of a three-year-old little boy who was hiding from the flames as they raced through his home that he shared with his mother and his three other siblings. One other thing I could probably tell you is that the other three children are being held for observation at the hospital for some minor smoke inhalation, but they didn't suffer any other injuries. Time is always critical when fire is involved. It only took the Sandusky Fire Department three and a half minutes to get to the house, but once inside, they had trouble finding the child. Um, initial reports from the mother and the three children that did get out did say that the child was in the living room on the first floor. Uh, the shift commander kind of, uh, concentrated his search efforts on that first floor, uh, but they didn't find him on the first floor. Again, the cause of the deadly fire is still under investigation. Several people spoke with that I spoke with want to uh, offer their condolences. They say they prayed for the family. I want to offer my prayers for the family as well. In Sandusky, I'm Harry Boomer, 19 News.